pants by the thousands, daily cleaning up about uh, a thousand exoskeletons of ants on a daily basis for about a month. New tonight, a building in southwest Atlanta neighborhoods is undergoing renovations. Management started making upgrades at the GE Tower in Mechanicsville. But some residents complain the conditions got worse once they moved back into their apartments. They complain of insects, mold, and rodents. Fox News' Christopher King spoke with a resident and the people trying to help the tenants. He's live at City Hall with more details. Christopher. Courtney Russ advocates complain some residents didn't even get signed leases. Others got double bill, they say. Now they want city leaders to do something to hold building management accountable. That's very frustrating. Leslie Reagan had to move out of her apartment when management launched renovations earlier this year. But this past August, Reagan moved back into a big problem. Pants by the thousands, daily cleaning up about uh, a thousand exoskeletons of ants on a daily basis for about a month. Management company Lincoln Avenue Capital began a multi-million dollar refurbishing project here at GE Tower on Glen Street in Atlanta's Mechanicsville neighborhood. Management sent pictures of the revamped units. They're revamping more than 200 units to help increase the city's stock of affordable housing. This process has been quite difficult for a lot of people. Management temporarily relocated some residents. Monica Johnson is with the Housing and Justice League. There are still people who are in hotels because the elevators don't work. Johnson says residents came back to unacceptable conditions and she says it's been like that much of the year. There was like a very extreme ant problem. The mold, rodents in some places, leaks, damaged, stolen property. Some residents didn't have signed leases. Some residents were getting double bill for utilities. Residents and advocates now calling on city leaders to investigate. They can do a better job of responding to the concerns of the residents there. Councilman Jason Dozier says he and Atlanta Housing have been meeting with management and residents. Just to make sure that all the parties were at the table to make sure that these meetings were taking place and these needs are being met. Lincoln Avenue would not speak with us on camera. Instead, they sent out a statement, quote, we have been committed to the comprehensive rehabilitation of the property while preserving and extending its affordability. We have invested more than $17 million in the community to renovate units and improve and expand the community amenities. Atlanta Housing says it's working with residents to get some answers from management. We're live at City Hall, Christopher King. Fox 5 News. Yeah, I can't imagine having to live in conditions like those. Christopher, thanks.